Sorry about that, guys. Got a phone call. Uh, as I was saying, if you have a truck in your area and that's common, don't you think you should do it? If you can afford it. Being a gray man is ideal. You don't want to look like you have everything. You don't want to look like G.I. Joe, G.I. Jane. Blend in. Don't walk around raising flags. As I was saying with the drones, if you can walk in, if you can observe a situation before you can you enter it, you have the upper hand right away. With lockdowns, that's that's something we're gonna have to start doing. With curfews. You can't be outside your house, right? Doesn't mean you can't fly a drone and look around. If you need to. You need to think about these things. You need to think how to blend in with the general population. As I was saying with the Reflectix. Don't be able for non-essential travel. If I'm driving around with Reflectix on, who averagely just drives around with Reflectix on? Nobody. Unless you're working. Right? Or going to work or traveling from one job site to another job site. So this is camouflage. Camouflage doesn't have to be Mossy oak or military style camel. Civilian camouflage right here. Blend in. Now, yes, I'm waiting. We got 30 centimeters of snow, so I'm just waiting to clear the snow off a job site, waiting for the guy to get here with the keys, so I thought I'd shoot this video. Um, because he's got my keys. <laughs> um so just think about stuff like that. If they're going to start limiting your movement, how can you how can you still gather intelligence? Information is ammunition. It's one of my favorite sayings. Along with the more you know, the less you carry. Those, those two are probably one and two on my top five favorite sayings. Information is ammunition is probably number one. You got to be able to gather intel and give intel without sticking out like a sore thumb. All right. What's the first thing? For example, what's the first thing? You're sitting in a mall's food court. What's the first thing you notice about a bunch of kids that walk in? They're noisy, right? For the most part, they're probably arrogant. They're rude. They're loud. They cause a scene just to gather attention. Well, in the way of life, given the current situation of the world. People who are talking uh, in public very openly about what most people would consider conspiracy theories and are very adamant about it and not posing the conversation as a form of a question as who appear to be stating facts you're those bunch of kids. And everyone else eating their lunch, that's everybody else in the world. They all recognize you. The person walking down the street in the middle of the city wearing mossy oak, I'm guilty of it. I'm a redneck, okay? I'm guilty of it. But so are all my friends. We just look like we don't belong there. We look like we're 
grabbing something and going back out to where we live. Okay, that's part of a diversionary tactic. If they don't think you live in the area, they're not going to follow you. Or they might. But you can tell when somebody's following you, and that's another video for another time. Now, it's not... It's not hard, guys. Being the gray man is not hard. It just takes a little bit of thinking. And unfortunately, moving forwards, that's our best camouflage. That's our best way to go, moving forwards. Be the gray man. Don't have yourself stuck out like a sore thumb. Think before you act. Think before you say things. Just blend in. It's going to get a lot worse before it gets better, guys. I'd strongly recommend people having cash on them. If you can afford it, get food make sure your vehicles are topped up with fuel all your contacts make sure you have a paper copy of their addresses of routes to get to their house physical maps and I know I'm probably preaching to the choir here when I say that but it's some things people don't think about. Never in my life did I think that it would come down to this. I was hoping we'd all be crazy. Start watching your backs. What Take care of your own. That's honestly the best thing we can all do right now. Take care of each other. A strong community is a lot more powerful than what you may think. Both connected together in friendship and in knowledge. The gray man theory is something you should be talking about with your closest people. Put it into practice, don't just talk about it, but put it into practice. It's, it's not, it can't be something that you just do randomly. It's got to be a way of life. If you're a gray man, you're a gray man. People's eyes are just going to right past you. That's the way you got to keep it. things to think about there guys all right stay safe out there get your gray man on get those supplies while you still can opb out